Hey guys, today I'm going to show you what all of the prefixes in front of your trigger samples mean. So when you see prefixes like Z1, NRG, or SSDR in front of your samples, they all have different meanings that will help you choose the right samples for your track. So let's start with the Z1s, which are the most commonly used samples in trigger. When you see the Z1 prefix, this means that they're mono samples. The Z1s have just the right amount of overhead miking combined with close miking, which gives them a three-dimensional full and punchy sound. They have air, depth, dimensionality, and impact, which makes them great all-around samples to use. Moving up to the Z2s, the Z2s are mono snare samples that are similar to the Z1s, but they've been further processed with a smooth compression to lessen the attack and enhance the decay. This makes them sit easily in the mix with less need for further processing. Now onto the Z3s. The Z3 samples are only printed with the very closest mics. They're super dry and don't really have much air, but they've been processed to retain the same punch of the Z1s. A great application for these is when you're augmenting your drums and you want that ultra dry drum sound. This works really well with heavy metal tracks when you want your drums to be as intimate and punchy as possible. Now let's check out the SSDR samples. These samples are stereo, real room ambient mic samples that were recorded in a large concrete warehouse. They're processed heavily with compression, EQ, and even a little bit of modulation. When you mix these in with the Z1 samples, you can adjust the amount of stereo room sound in the drum mix. You can even use the SSDR samples to add more room tone to your recorded drums as well. One thing to note is that if you're listening to the SSDR samples soloed, they may sound a bit strange by themselves, but when you combine them with their corresponding Z1 samples in your mix, they'll give you a very rich, deep, and natural sound. And last but certainly not least are the NRG samples. These samples are a set of ambient mics from the famous NRG recording studio A Room. This room is big and open sounding with great depth and detail. The NRG samples are completely unprocessed, which means that you can compress or EQ them, or you can leave them untouched if that's your vibe. So that covers all of the sample prefixes in Trigger 2. And if you want to create your own custom samples for Trigger, be sure to check out the free Trigger Instrument Editor, which lets you create your own multi-velocity round-robin drum samples to use in Trigger 2. That's all from me, and happy mixing.